cute little chips. One of the lifting strikes on the keel. But the boat looks really good, um, good shine to it. I'm gonna try to point out any major issues it does have. So on your back engine hatch, you've got a few chips in the paint itself. This boat's in storage right now, um, so the batteries actually need to be charged up. So I'm not going to be able to show you the engine hatch this time around. Vinyl's in good shape. There's a few vinyl areas in the seats and the seams that are starting to pull away. Um, carpet could use a detail or change it out completely. That's where the seam where the vinyl sort of pulling away in all these pieces but a lot of room in the 42 very comfortable bolsters So it has an option to change up the steering um, if you so choose. Some type of Garmin. And the deck looks really good. Um, lighting in here is a little bit rough to see, but uh, paint looks good there. Okay, so we're gonna use the phone light right now because the batteries are out. But here's your panel. You have a cooler underneath that. To your right. Have the head area, some storage, vacuum flush, you got your ladder right there as well. Um, headliner has just some spots from mildew that we have tried to clean, so that has stained the vinyl itself. But there is no issue of mildew. Um, there is some, some wet items down below for too long. And that's how that occurred, unfortunately. But the vinyl down below is in very good shape. Still very comfortable. Sorry about the quality of the video. Um, if you would like a new video with charged batteries, let me know. I'll take you to the cockpit one more time. Here are your drives. They look to be in good shape. It's a little bit of just some paint chipping. 
on them, but cosmetically, they look really good. Got your big K-planes. That's where you hook on your swim ladder. And we are tight in this storage building, but I will uh, see what I can do for you on this side. The starboard and the port side on your paint look great. Um, haven't seen anything major other than what I've pointed out before. You got a little bit of a chip here from probably putting it on the trailer itself. There it is. Let me know what you think.